I'd rather do Pachinko. Fantastic. Let's get right to it. Boy, memory is still fresh. So look at the site from here. There's a giant slide. Oh, God. I didn't think we'd be tested on this. A magic girl. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's right. I remember now. The next one I need to talk to you about. Which snow statue is right in the middle? Um, Isn't it a crystal? Wait, really? Don't remember that one. Yeah, no mistake. Across from the sa slide, there's another Doroma. A massive one, if I recall. Oh god, I don't know. Treasure ship? <laughs> Next to the penguin? A dragon. Oh no, it's a fox. Yeah, I, I literally found... So I did the pachinko to start with. Uh, and that literally took five hours off stream of me grinding pachinko and reloading to get the, like, ones that I could sell. And then when I got to the second area, you just have to have enough money to buy the books. And then if you buy a, a certain set, you can trade them in for a scroll. And then you can constantly sell the scroll for more money, buy the books. And then you can get to a point where you can buy 50 of each book, get 50 scrolls. And then sell 50 scrolls for like 100,000. And then you can buy all the books you need. Uh, all the moves. But it is the most pointless grind. Because you never use any of the moves. So, yeah. It definitely makes... If, the, if you just take that grinding out of Shenmue 3. The game is like a solid 6 out of 10. But with all that grinding, it's literally like a 4 out of 10. And then you've got the end as well, which is literally. Yeah. Yeah. The ending is so bad. You don't even punch him. You don't even land it like you'd 50 hours of grinding. And you don't even punch the big bad guy. Oh, you notice Steve's face? Yeah, we got a box Steve. We had him over the microphone, but I, I always move the microphone about. But yeah, we've got a, a, a sealed ste. There he is. He's chilling. Limited edition Xbox original ste. <laughs> I, I, I slowly want to put more people on the shelves just to see if people will notice it. I think we definitely have to put Otis... In the fucking box. The Shenmue box. I think we have to do that. Mm. Cunt's well used. <gasps> well, a well used Justice Stee plays good games badly. Been waiting since 1999. Mate, I was waiting from the previous day. Because I was very late to Shemu. Yeah, are you all going to base rush him? You'd need to base rush him. When you're planning on playing like a, a cool, like a, a chill game with friends. And there's that one friend that goes to YouTube and finds all the cheese strats. I can't <coughs> I can't remember which um, Age of Empires I played. It definitely was wasn't four. Earn more experience points when finishing off enemies with charged attacks. Ooh, okay, I'll take that. Increase your heat guard by psyching yourself up to extreme. 
Force down enemies onto their feet. I'll take that. Right, can I go this way, please? Thank you. Right, we're nearly there. <gasps> oh, no, we're not going to be able to fight the rich guy. This guy in front's going to get us. Damn. You never had a PC till like three years ago. So it's just four for you. Yeah, I was, I've always been a console gamer. Even now, I have a PC, but I just use my PC to stream. Hi. Yo, Mr. Blackheart Daddy, how you doing, mate? Oh, I totally missed that. Right, you pooped, you're going to sleep. Yo, take care, Steve, man. Love you, dude. Have yourself a good sleep, mate. Oh, that was so close. Oh. Come here. Oh, you little bitch. You doing good? Yeah, I'm doing all right, mate. We're playing some, uh, some more Yakuza. We got pretty hooked yesterday. We ended up doing like a fucking eight hour stream. This game is disgusting though. Look how many encounters you get into. And I mean, we're already over leveled to fuck anyway, but. Trish, I actually own every possible way to play Shenmue. I own it on Dreamcast, I own the PlayStation. I own the Xbox version. I own the Xbox original version. I think I'm just a bit of a fanboy. I kind of want to play it though, again, but with Japanese voice acting. But then I think it's just going to be a shit game. Um, because it won't have quite have the charm of the, the incredible voice acting. Ooh, there's another thing here. I need to do uh, more getting people... What I need to do more than getting people to play AoE is to get people on Command and Conquer. Yeah, Red Alert looks like good fun. I think I've still got that downloaded. Right. Here we go. Next main mission. Dude, hell, I loved Red Alert 2. Me and Tom used to play Red Alert 2 after school every single day for so long. It is literally the best. How do we get into the casino? I don't know what you mean. This, this is a bar. Should have figured you'd want a tip. How much? I have no idea what you're talking about. There's no gambling. If you have a drink, if it's a drink you want, I can do that. We're a bar, you know. Okay. Guessing the guy in the corner. You never played Red Alert 2? Yeah, Red Alert 2 is great. As soon as I read that, I started to hear the music play in my head. <laughs> Dude. A game of billets. No, I don't want to play with billets. Because computer cheat. I'm sorry this area is close to the public. Well, what do I need to do? I'm guessing if we try to go out, we're going to get collared. Evening. Hey, do you shoot, pal? I'm so tired of playing regulars here. Challenge you to a match. Don't you want to know how to get into the casino? That's not important, but come on. How about it? If you win, I'll tell you how to get in. Or if you're not much of a pool player. Well, I've already said too much. Why don't you forget we ever talked and I'll let you settle my bar tab today. 50 grand. 
Oh, I'll pay 50 grand. I'm I'm literally half a millionaire, mate. I'm not playing pool. Also, you guys are going to hate me, but in three months' time, when I redeem Shenmue, as my... Oh, mate, if you do that, I will happily allow you to do that, Trish. And we will do... We'll try and collect all Pachinko, as it's the best thing about Shenmue. I'm down. Which Shenmue, though? One or two? Probably going to be Shenmue 2. Okay. I, di um, I don't remember Shenmue 2 as much as the first one, to be honest. But we'll definitely... Um, I remember Otis saying, Oh, we'll beat this one. And then he didn't even get off disc one. He didn't even get off disc one. I uh, guess I better find that homeless guy. Okay, right, we've got to go out. I love how three isn't... E Mate, you could have been evil there and said Shenmue 3. And then I probably would have banned you. I need to pass for a casino, but the old homeless guy has got one. In where? In Katoya. Is that a street or like a an area? Katoya. Katoya, Katoya, Katoya. Main public park. Katoya. Oh, hang on. It's this one. Katoya works. Oh, God. It's ages away. We've got such a long run. Fluff player's Deadly Prime. Mate, it's definitely on my list. It, Deadly Prem, um, can can you get number two on, on Steam or is it just on Switch? Uh. We're so good, so cheesy, but you loved it. Mate, I've heard good things about the new Guardians film. It's meant to be like the best... Um, the best Marvel film since Endgame, but... I'll give you my account to save you money. Oh, no, man. Don't worry about that. I'll end up buying it anyway. Because isn't the best way to play the first, the PS3 version, right? Because it's the director's cut. Yeah, we'll probably... So we'll do that then. And I'll buy it physically for that. You liked it better than Guardians 2? See, I, I really like the first Guardians film. I thought number two was like a bit too much. I don't know how we even unlock the uh, the charge moves. Because in the in four, you could always charge. Oh no, I, I could I could get it. I could pick it up myself. Don't worry, man. I, I definitely it's something that I've uh, since you've said that um, you really like it. I've always been interested in it, and I do remember playing a bit of the first one back in the day. It was just like when I was a bit of a weird gamer, and all I'd play was FIFA, so I wasn't into much. Come on, fuck me, dude. Nice.
Did not mean to do this. Dude, it's weird. I hardly ever use Steam. I don't remember the last game I streamed that was on Steam. Or on my computer, in fact. That's not emulated. And I'm playing... I think I'm going to play Yakuza 6 on Steam because I think it's locked at 6... at 30. On console. Ooh, a nameless katana. That's not a bad drop. Oh, you're going to try and get the plat on it? Dude, I'd love to, like, trophy hunt, but I, I just lose interest in games. Unless it's, you can bop, you can do it in, like, one playthrough. I, I, I usually can do it, but if it's, like, three or four playthroughs... I mean, he's not getting up any time soon. The thing is, as well, you know what's annoying about the PS5? If you play PS4 games on it, it, it doesn't, it doesn't automatically fucking um, do the frame, the f FPS boost. Whereas like the Series X, as every game I've put in has had an FPS boost. I mean, this probably does. This runs at 60 anyway, but like when I played Force Unleashed, I couldn't believe how good it looked. Hang on, is this just the place that we are? A place out of the wind and rain. I think it was a, was a covered shopping area around somewhere. Oh, fuck, hang on. I'm being an idiot. I think I know exactly where that is. Isn't it over here? Mate, I know, it's crazy. It's the only annoying thing with Sony, right? Their backwards compatibility is shit. Like, they just don't have an excuse for it. To think that you can put, uh, like, literal original Xbox discs in the, in the Series X and they still work is kind of crazy. Dude, we got big XP there. That's a lot of XP. Right, is it here? Am I thinking, is this the, oh no, this is wrong. Boys, I don't know where this guy could be. Out of the shelter and wind, in the shelter and wind. Oh there this is in the shelter right there we go until I see a random metroidvania then um, then find I can get it physically for double the price though unlimited run
Dude, it's crazy how many games Tom has for this Switch. How many homeless? You're not talking unless you get it right. Does this fella even know what to do? Research shit? Huh? How am I supposed to know how many homeless people are here? I guess I'll ask around. Okay. I heard there's an escape prisoner on the run. Okay, well these don't know. Yeah, and he's got like a lot of limited run ones as well. Like he was, he got um, the Shanty limited run and he was going to collect them all, but then one of them is like over 200 quid. Dude, I saw the Kotor limited run. Oh, 500. Yeah, that's disgusting. That's like Metal Gear 2 Solid Snake fucking price, that. Which I do want to get this year at some point. That's going to be me saving up Twitch money though, I think. Hang on, we could... Ooh, maybe this guy will know. I mean, there's only 71 homeless people. Yes. I could kiss that man right on his cock. Dude, it was funny. When, when Tom came over the other day, right? We... We have both ended up ordering things. Like, I ordered the Shenmue thing. What's this? A photo of a certain spot in town keeping out for it will lead you to where, where you seek. Hang on. That's up. That's further up the road. I know exactly where that is. And then I think I bought some games from CEX. I think. Tom got a Hades from C CEX on, this, on the Switch. Which I didn't realise Hades had a fucking physical. Oh, it's here. Is this it? Is it not this this one? Oh, is it round the other side of it? We, oh no, we can't get on the road. What's in the background of it? Right, it's not here. I'm guessing it's maybe over there? Across the road, maybe? Fuck, I can't cross. With Chain Decodes, um, Gal Guardians, The Last Faith, all of which I know when they'll arrive. Don't you know when, well, when they'll arrive? Dude, that game that I told you about that I saw in the retro shop, that looks fucking sick. That's like, um, that's like Chrono Trigger. It looks like Chrono Trigger and kind of like um, Chain Decodes. Right, it must be that down there. Right, let's cross. The sea something. I can't remember what it's, exactly what it's called now. Uh. But yeah, there's a lot of... I want to get all the Star Wars games and there's a fucking load of Star Wars games limited run. This is the one. This photo... This phone booth. It's the one in the photo. Or the last spell. Are they all switch? Sea of Stars. That's it. Yeah, that game looks really good. And that's out soon. Go to the lottery kiosk. The password is seven scattered losing tickets. Are you fucking kidding? We're playing cat and mouse here. 
please tell me that this is... Right, okay, thank God. Yeah, that Sea of Stars looks really good. Mm -mm -mm. I hope... Um, does um, Chrono Cross have a physical? I know it doesn't on PlayStation. I'm guessing it's going to be a Switch job, right? Because I want to get the Japanese version of Chrono Cross... Uh, Chrono Trigger. Mate, I'm going to have to do a Play Asia order because I want the thingy as well. I want what do you call it? The Pixel Remaster. Did you know you can still actually buy a PS1 game from Play Asia? I think it's Play Asia. Or it might be the Square Enix store. Seven. Scattered. Um, losing tickets. Underground Casino Pass. Right. We did it. Thank fucking God. Yeah, it looks really good, Chain Echoes. I love, like, the exploration. Oh, I wonder what this guy's move is with it. Kiru's move. Oh, shit. Come on. Oh, yeah, he's going to do the same. He's going to ride it. Mate, so you got the collector's edition of that? Dude, I wonder how big that's going to be. Mate, I'm pretty much out of room. Oh, I made another save. I didn't mean to do that. That's why I want to get rid of the bed that no one sleeps in. Uh, that sold out on the SNES box version. Oh, I love... You know, it, although the game is kind of trash, Doom 64, the limited run copy of Doom 64 is so nice. Show the barkeeper? So he did know about it. Right. Mate, what do you get with the collectors? Please go on through. Right. I really hope we don't have to play anything. Only two days left till the snow festival. Nothing quite like knocking back a few drinks to keep warm. Hey, there's going to be lots of people here this year too. That's good. With all the sponsors ditching over the past two years, I was afraid the festival was going to flat out disappear or some shit. They say the big crowds this year would be because of the old man. Patriarch um, Kitaka. Yeah. Apparently he's he's scared up sponsors all across um, Hokkaido and, di and didn't let let up until the festival was fully funded. Can Hell I get yeah. any That's of you cunts guy. a drink? Oh, you sent it? Suck me off. Also, hello. Yo. Oh, this is the one that you bought, Tom. Ooh. Dude, and it'll... Mate, look how nice that is. And you're going to keep it sealed, right? And the SNES one. Yo, cloves, you're alright, mate. Yo, I think I've got a little bit in my McDonald's drink. Ooh. Dude, that is nice. 
Oh, the box inside's even. <gasps> oh, man. I bet you that's going to go for so much, this, this SNES version. Yo, Apollo, how you doing, mate? Are you off to York tomorrow, dude? I remember you mentioning something about York. Oh, imagine got the SNES version. That is fucking sick. Yo, Cloves, how you doing, mate? Trust me, I was there. The mayor. He treated um, Kitaka with total respect. It was something to behold. Glad I'm in his family. Let me tell you. Well, the mayor should have some respect. This festival wouldn't be happening without the old man. Also explains why he's a guest of honor. What? Now there's some useful info. You didn't know? Kitaka's going to be in the festival's opening ceremony with all the other guests in front of the special stage. He also hates stuffed um, stuffed shirt events. Won't this, uh, won't this be torture for him? For some reason, he cheerfully accepted this particular invite. Yo. Doing all right? You just lurking? Love you. Yo, I love you too, mate. Yo, I hope you're having a... Are you playing some Val and winning, mate? You got... Oh, you're going Monday? You got some last minute shit? So you leave Monday, return Monday? Oh, you're going away for a week? Oh, that'd be well nice, dude. Are you going away, all three of you? Dude, York is amazing. I, I could spend a month in York. Also, there's a few nice retro shops that Steel probably have you um, look... Go, go and have a look for him. Yep. Wait a second. Is this about Tojo Officer, the dead guy? There's, there was a Super Collectors that was like 300 euros. Mate, I was I was so close to getting this the the big Collectors Edition of um, Final uh, the Pixel Remaster, but. It didn't even come with a physical copy of a game. It came with a code for the game. And it was 250 quid. And that was enough for me to be out. It's like, if it would have been a nice, like, fucking box, right? But knowing it didn't have a game in it was a no for me. Like, it had the game. It just had a code for the game. Make the super collectors. Oh, so you get everything with that? Oh, you get a wooden music box. And you get like a necklace, collectible coins, art book. Dude, you get a lot in that. And two more coins? Yeah, there was like three coins. Mate, that's pretty sick, but 200 quid is like... Yeah, 200 more is... It's a lot, right? And I don't really... I wouldn't get a collector's edition that comes with a statue, because... Like, other than... Like, I really like that statue, but I don't want to plaster my fucking room with statues. I'd much, I'd much rather get, like, different fucking Star Wars helmets than statues. And that's generally what they do. They just chuck a plastic fucking uh, statue in, in in some collectors. So it's nice seeing that like that has like a prop that looked like pr pretty nice. Because like the Resident Evil, I really wanted to get the Resident Evil Seven collectors when that came out. Because that had like a house, but and then I remember it being kind of good. And then I was reading up reviews, and the house was fucked. People were receiving houses that didn't, the light didn't work, that it was broken, that it wasn't even, um, it was nothing like it was sold to look like. So I was like, yeah, I'm kind of glad I dodged that bullet. He doesn't know when to quit. Don't think this is over, he'll hunt you down. You can't escape, Kitaka. Uh -oh. Oh, you bought a portable aircon unit. Dude, I need to buy a fucking thing for the window because it's starting to get warm. Mate, they are the best thing. It's the best thing I've ever bought. I'm not kidding you. Oh, fuck. Look at all these missions that have just popped up. 
Would you like some matches? It's 100 gem per box, but if only a few, that would be good too. You need to trade the Fallout 76 collectors in. How much do you get for that at CEX? Dude, I really like Fallout, but I don't know if I'd collect all the... Because some of the collector's editions, are, like, that's a good one. But I remember the Fallout 3 one that comes with just a lunchbox. It looks pretty cool. And then didn't like Fallout... Set, uh, Fallout um, New Vegas. That came with like a pack of cards. I don't even remember what the collector's edition was on that. And the Fallout 4 one was the Pip-Boy. But now all every phone doesn't fit in it. You've got Vegas 4 into the 76. Dude, the 76 one's so good. You get a £100 voucher. Yeah, that's tempting, right? Mate, I, I really want the... Um, I really want the Metal Gear 5 collectors because it has the fucking big boss arm. <sighs> this is what it's all come to. Hey... Hit, hit me with another. <sighs> Not to worry, my man. Next one it is. <laughs> Keep it one trade in the other. Oh, you've got two seventy-six collectors. Oh yeah, I remember you and you and Natasha got one each, right? Because you got two, the the fucking um, what's it? The duffel bag. <laughs> Dude, you could sell the duffel bag alone for, like, big money. I'm sure people would buy that. How, can you actually wear the helmet? Is the helmet wearable? You've worn it before. Mate, you know when you played Fallout, you should have done a redeem to wear the fucking helmet. It, it, it's kind of it, like yesterday when I, people kept redeeming the helmet for me. Like, I forget like how fun shit like that is sometimes. And then when it comes to actually being, having to look at things, you just can't see shit. Because you have like the vision of nothing. Tried wearing a pit boy. Can barely move your arm. <laughs> Dude, it was so cool though. I, I've never seen one of those in person. I really want to get Fallout 1 and 2 big box, but they're rare. I can only find like German copies of the of Fallout 1. European version has a bunch of stuff removed. What, from Fallout? Oh! From the first two, like this, um, more of the top violence. Over the top violence. Oh, that is nice. Oh, dude, that is so nice. Yeah, I remember that one. Charge up heat. Mate, they're all... I know, if, like, Fallout's a bit of a weird one, right? With like collector's editions, because they've even been like hit or miss. Like the lunchbox, I just remember that being like, that was fucking everywhere. Pick. I'll send you. I'll put it in chat.
This is it. That's not it, by the way. That's a picture I sent to Watson earlier. There you go. The second link. The first one is just a picture of me eating the one chip challenge and my tongue's all blue. That needs to be an emote. If this is a Rick Roll, I'm going to be upset with you. No, it's not. Don't worry. Now I want the Gears of War Retro Lancer. Yeah, Apollo, I was the same. I never got a special edition. The only special edition... Oh, God. I literally don't... I want to turn my stream off after sharing this. The only special edition I ever bought as a child... was Duke Nukem Forever. And uh, my heart was broken that much that uh, I never, I vowed to never buy another collector's edition again. Dude, you can get a full to scale Lancer. Do you want me to share? Um, yo, Shen. If you're looking at a stream, this is what I sent. Gazo Security. So it's the nuclear shell and it has all the games in it. Fallout 1 all the way up to Fallout 4. I don't think it has new Vig um, 76 in it. And then the other picture was even better, was this. It looks like I took a cum shot from an alien. Yeah. You bought the Halo, um, second Halo and Halo 3 Legendary with a helmet. Oh, the one with the helmet? Didn't you put games in the helmet? I can't remember. I can't remember what was special about that. Did someone mug this little girl? Although I was kind of tempted. You know when the um, 7 Remake came out? When they were doing the fucking statue of Squall on the bike. I was like, yeah, that's kind of cool. I could buy that. Gotta get some food. Oh, fuck. Are you kidding? Dude, and you'd know, right? For part three, they're definitely going to do a high wind model. Like, they've got to do a high wind, surely. Imagine, like, a to scale high wind with all the detail. Ugh. I think I would finish. Alright, we need to find a shop. I think there's a shop across the road. No, this is not a shop. Um, Tavin, what's this? I think down there, that's got to be a shop. If you like real resi stuff, you have to see the shit my mate Andy has. Dude, there's a, there's a briefcase edition. You know the... Oh no, this is just another thing. Mate, where are all the fucking supermarkets at? There's literally a briefcase edition, which was sent out as a dev kit for Code Veronica. You know the, the fucking, please place all metallic items in the security box. You know that fucking thing that you get that you cut out the non-metallic symbol? You literally can get that exact thing with the gaming. And it has loads of like documents from the game as well. It's really cool. But you can't get that for like under, like, four hundred quid. He's got large-scale models of William. Oh, I see. 
I'm really... They brought out, like, um, recently, they did, like, a Tyrant, a Nemesis. And there was a really old one of, of Birkin. But definitely, if they did, like, a... Um, if they did a full model of Birkin, I would buy that shit. But he's not dead. I've seen a liquor bust on Bork stream and that looks mint. Yeah, that's fucking expensive though. Isn't that like four or five hundred quid? Oh fuck, I just threw up in my mouth. That was nice. Dude, isn't there like a lewd statue of this? Isn't there like an even lewder one? I can't remember which one it was now. Oh my god, they do an A2. No, Rubbers, you, this is the one you want, mate. <laughs> you want that one. That's the better one to get, surely, right? <laughs> oh... Grabbing the lube. You grabbing your buster sword? Yeah, Apollo, get pictures. And then Apollo, tell tell us his address. And we can all three way, we can take a, a statue each. Nice. He's got William, Nemesis, and the liquor. Dude, that's sick. Uh, my sister has both um, the Nemesis one and the Tyrant. The Tyrant. I mean, it's no wonder that, like, all these people... It's like Batman. He says he never kills people, right? But we full well know that he definitely does. There's no way that these aren't dead. Uh, further boost damage... Oh, okay, we'll take that. Yeah, we'll take that. I need some food. So where they die cast? They're probably like um, proper models, but I don't know the material that it would be. Right, we'll get a, a Tonsuku ramen. <clears throat> Tom's got a few. Um, Near Automa statue. Uh, well, figures from Japan when he went. Toby and not Toby. How much is that Final Fantasy VII collectors? Is it just disgusting money? Let's have a look on eBay.
Um, oh no, the model only is 250 or best offer. I mean, it's a pretty sexy box. Eight hundred pounds for a sealed one. Yeah, that's disgusting. Also, I just found that Final Fantasy Crisis Core remake or whatever it is um, literally has a steel book. So, thank you, eBay. Right, I really don't care about any of this. Right, let's go back. He paid two fifty for William, dude. Um, I found one ages ago. It might be the same one that he's got, um, and it was going for like three four hundred pounds. He attempted to try Shenmue. What, even after Otis has talked all the shit about it? You're still tempted, Blackheart? Are you just going to do it so you can have bragging rights? He's on sale. Yeah, he's um. You probably get it for a couple. Uh, co get it for a couple of quid. I mean, on all my like normal copies of Shemu, not the ridiculous sealed one I got for ninety quid. They all cost me like under five pounds. It was only the Dreamcast ones that were like more than that. This guy looks like he's gonna pick a fight with me. You can't trust Otis' opinion after Eternal Darkness. See, Otis has a weird opinion on games. Oh my god. That's the liquor. Is that the one? No, that's different to what thing he has, right? Yeah, that's the Birkin one. I do remember that. I've seen that one around. That is fucking sick, man. That's my favourite version of Birkin as well. And then he's also got the Nemesis one. Oh, mate. So he's got the 1 to 4 ratio. Dude, I'd, I'd get the life-size bust for that. Dude, that is sick. Plus 3 is in the PS Plus. Dude, even I say this as a person who really thinks that Shenmue 1 and 2 is, is you know, semi-decent. Good games, right? Don't do, Shen don't do Shenmue 3. Um, you will go insane. Shenmue 3 is literally the most gr it's the most grind for the least reward I've ever done in a game although it was kind of hilarious we got a tyrant statue as well oh you see this is cool because that's the OG tyrant from the original Resident Evil not remake I think yeah it's 21 inches Dude, that shit is going to be so expensive to get secondhand. But I do generally do think that um buy the rest of the boxes of the matches. I do generally think that I don't think anyone else would enjoy Shenmue like I did. Cuz I kind of got the jank and just thought it was amazing. Whereas everyone else will just see that it's janky as fuck and want to rip out their eyeballs. Yo, those statues are really cool. He always bought them as soon as they're released. Yeah, there's only 750. Dude, when I play Deadly Prem, right? 
I'll compare it to Shenmue. And if I think that it's anything like Shenmue, I'll be like, I think generally you'd probably be able to get through Shenmue. I don't know if you'd enjoy it, but... The thing as well with um, the first Shenmue is... Oh, we've got a protective arm. Oh. Is you can run out of time, so you can game over if you take too long. So that that's the only thing that, like, made me a little bit nervous about playing it. Because what if I've played it for 15 hours and then ran out of time and lost? Right. We're going... We're doing the mission now because we're just fucking stalling at this point. Um oh, it's only got one. Fuck it. Yeah, those statues are so nice, right? Dude, I, I remember as a kid, right, I'd go to Meadow Hall and in Meadow Hall they would literally have all the classic RE figures, you know like the the Resident Evil 2 um, they, they had like Claire, um, Leon, Birkin, a Cerberus, and I uh, never was allowed to buy them. My mum wouldn't let me buy them. Because I said to her, well, if I buy them, I'm not going to take them and play with them. I'm just going to keep them in the box. Oh, well, I'm not buying them, you then. <laughs> so I missed out on them. See the new World Heavyweight Championship? Yeah, it looks pretty good, right? I just don't like the big W on it. That's my only thing. They have to plaster their fucking brand over all their belts. Without the W, though, it would be really nice. Well, it would just look like, like the AEW belt, right? Yukimatsuri,の最中ですよね。結局、俺たち近寄れないじゃないですか。31 inch Master Chief toy? Have you got this? Mate, it's taken ages to load. That's how epic it is. それじゃあ... Did we just DDoS that website? Anyway, I saw it. Was the WWE 02 version. Yeah, it's like the old WCW World Heavyweight title, right? With like a modern twist. Dude, I'd love to get the um, the old winged belt. If I was to ever buy an actual belt, it would be the old winged belt. The WWE Championship. Dude, we, we DDoS the website. Yo, Apollo, that's how that's how washed up Master Chief is, mate. He can't handle three. He can't handle three people clicking his link. You bought for twenty five, and it's now worth two fifty. Have you still got it then? It's costing you to know nothing, Kayla. Two issues. I'm a single guy. 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 I'm a single it won't load. Yeah, that's what I meant. Like, it's just like, 